This is a big truck and it's running on gas. I'll get a close up of that. This is like an 18 wheeler. They're filling it right now. You can see the filler. These are the gas bottles that it runs on. So two, four, six, eight, eight of them. And I see the connection that comes down to here and then goes into the engine somewhere. Can't see that. And there's the other side of it. And as you can see, it's a big dump truck. Huh. This is the, the gas tank of a taxi. This is the CNG, as you can see, or NGV. And it's just, uh, yeah, just stuck in the trunk and they have a cover right here for it that goes over it. And yes, it takes up a lot of the trunk space, but on the other hand, this is a dual, this taxi is a dual fuel. It has gasoline and, and uh, natural gas. It uh, has a switch on the inside and they could just switch from one to the other. This is the filler. This one's in the front, I've seen them in the back. And the valve that switches over is down in here, we can't really see it. It's not my taxi, so I can't, can't mess with it too much. But yeah, there's the switch that goes from gasoline to, uh, to uh, natural gas. This little switch is how they switch over. You can see the gas down here, and this is the gasoline up here. So this is natural gas, gasoline, and it's just a rubberized switch. You push on the bottom and push on the top. And here it shows he's running on gasoline for me. But you can see the little red lights on, which means he's almost out of gasoline. <laughs> okay, well that was it. Hope you found it useful and interesting for, for uh, natural gas-powered vehicles.